So welcome back to Vietnam. I have very good news for those who are coming to Vietnam this summer. In today's episode, I'll talk about the new e-visas. It was only a 30-day single entry visa and also the visa exemption. But whether the United States, Canada or Australia is on the list of the visa-free countries. So let's get started. So hello there. If you see me talking about the Vietnam passport the second or even a third time, most likely you are not subscribed. Therefore, this is a sign that you should subscribe to our channel. You can get free content information from me as an investor and also an attorney who's been living in Vietnam for over 10 years. So why not subscribe? In case you don't know me, my name is Ken Jung, international business immigration attorney with over 15 years of experience helping individuals and companies invest, get second citizenship, and live all over the world, including the United States, Grenada, Portugal, Thailand, Singapore, and many other parts of the world. So let's talk about what is the current e-visa system in Vietnam. So in 2007, Vietnam implemented an online registration, which is called electronic visa, that which allowed for various countries around the world to apply online without having to go to the embassy or the consulate. However, that system is flawed because they only allow for 30 day and single entry. So for many of the folks who wanted to come in for tourism to Vietnam, Thailand, other countries, and then come back for the round trip flights, that was not available. And especially for business people who were coming to Vietnam and doing business for more than 30 days. So that system that's implemented in 2017 went through the pandemic. Now we're in 2023 past the pandemic and it was still using the same system which hindered a lot of the tourism and the business to come back similar to Thailand, Singapore and many of the other Southeast Asian countries. The second item to talk about is the visa exemption. So Vietnam uh, has about roughly 25 countries as of January 2022 that allows the passport holders to enter Vietnam without applying for an e-visa or without applying for a visa or visa on arrival. Uh, most of those countries are in ASEAN due to the ASEAN Free Trade Agreement, which now has 11 member countries. And then the rest are some European countries and other countries that Vietnam has had a multilateral, bilateral, or a unilateral agreement with them to allow those people to come in between 14 to 90 days at a time without a visa. Now to the fun part. In order to attract more tourists, to Vietnam and also to stimulate the economy, uh, Vietnam proposed and also looked at the work of uh, Thailand and Singapore and their policies to attract more tourists back to the country after the pandemic. In January of 2023, General Tho Lam, Minister of Public Security, proposed new regulations at the 15th Assembly in Hanoi in order to come up with a new policy. So we made a video about the new Vietnam visa policies. You can check out that video by clicking on the right hand corner. On June 24th, 2023 at the 15th Assembly in Hanoi, the uh, government approved the regulations that are very important for the visas. And this is dealing with law on foreigners on the entry, exit, transit and residence in Vietnam. And within these regulations, there are two main points that I want to bring to you today. Number one, regarding the e-visas, prior to the regulations, it was only a 30-day single entry visa. But now it's allowed for 90 days and multiple entry visas. This helps tremendously for the tourists who want to travel to multiple countries and also the business people who need to come in and out of Vietnam during their longer stay in Vietnam. And if they want to do six months, then they just do one border run within 90 days. The second important regulation is extending the visa exemption from 15 days to 45 days for those 25 countries on the list of uh, visa exempt countries around uh, the world and especially here in Southeast Asia. So I've gotten a lot of questions about whether the United States, Canada or Australia is on the list of the visa free countries. Just like before, these countries were not on the list because of reciprocity between the two. Vietnamese needs to get visas to go to those countries. That means those countries would need to get visas to come to Vietnam as well. So when will this new law come into effect? So right now the proposal is for August 15th, 2023, 
the new law will come into effect to have the 90 days and the 45 days for these visas. So for those who have already applied for the e-visa or already uh, plan to come in before August 15th, you're still subjected to the old rules. Nevertheless, this news is really great for investors, tourists, and other folks who just want to come explore the culture, eat the amazing food, uh, tourism, and also explore investment opportunities in Vietnam. So as an investor and also an attorney here in Vietnam for 10 years, uh, we've looked at many retail businesses, professional services, even entertainment, and we've crafted many options uh, for you from uh, visas, multiple entries, to visa exemptions of five years, investor visas, and other uh, substitutes for retirement visas that you can have in order to invest long-term in Vietnam or retire. So definitely contact us if you have questions about how to invest and retire in Vietnam as we have many different options for you and I'd be happy to give you a tailored consultation to understand what you need to do step by step and then an execution plan as well. So we've applied for hundreds of e-visas under the 30-day plan. We can also do the 90-day new visa for you. So if you're planning to come to Vietnam after August 15th, make sure you contact our legal team and we'll let you know if you're in an approved country and you can get the e-visa smoothly, uh, diligently and easily within three to five business days after you apply with us. So make sure you contact our team in order to get your 90-day e-visa. So myself and the DEG team looks to welcome you to Vietnam on a 90-day visa instead of that 30 days so you can explore, invest and look at Vietnam as this amazing country. But as always, thank you very much for watching this video. But make sure you like our Facebook page, subscribe to our YouTube channel, comment below about the 90-day visa, and click on the bell for notifications. So thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you on the next one.